Good morning. It is Friday and we are having some work done on the house. Actually our driveway. It's getting resealed this afternoon which is going to be really good. It's been two years since we've had it done and it just we really want to try to protect the driveway and the investment of that driveway as long as we can. But because we're having the driveway sealed, the kids are like all over the place watching this. And Charity's making some cornbread. But in, in the spirit of the um, pantry cleanout challenge, we are serving canned soup. And if this gives you any sense of how the kids prefer my cooking over canned stuff, as Charity said, I'll take the cornbread and skip the soup. <laughs> so. We have one can here, and we have another can here from the sounds of it. Nobody's going to touch it, but we're going to eat, oh, it. eat it. They'll eat it. You know they will. Uh, we're going to put that out for part of our lunch with cornbread, and that will be two more items out of the pantry. Yay! Yay! We ended up using three cans of the soup mix in for our lunch today, so that's three cans out of the pantry. And then I also used a can of pumpkin to make a pumpkin cake because we're going to some friend's house for dinner tonight. Here is the pumpkin cake. It's all done. So I'm going to go ahead and pull this out because you can just tell it's done. See? It's got no... No bouncy spring to it, so... Well, it does have spring, I guess. When it doesn't have spring, it's not done. You can just tell. Because it's All right. brown. We'll let that it's sat for a few brown. minutes, and then we'll flip it, and we're going to put some frosting on it. The friends that are having us are over. They have three uh, smaller children. I think they're ages five and under, but they wanted to have our family over, which is like, it's crazy having... Um, we'll have ten kids... For four adult adults. Thank you. Oh, she's doing baby push-ups. She's doing crawl. She's trying to crawl. Oops. She fell. She's gonna try it again. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, up on the haunches. Look at this, guys. Ooh. Come on. Getting stronger. Come on. Baby. Come on. Can you do push-ups? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Gentle John. Mm -hmm. Be careful with her. She's ready to just get crawling. Go, go, mm -hmm. go. You wanna do push-ups? Push-ups, do this, Lily. She's like, I really want to get it. Lydia knows how to do push-ups. We're also in the process of doing laundry. We haven't finished yet, and then we want to vacuum the whole house before we leave. It's always so much better if the house is neat, tidied, and clean before we leave. So when we get home tonight, whatever time that is, probably 8, 8.30, we won't have to worry about cleaning the house. And then maybe Art can have a little time to... Um, either relax or work on a project that he wants to. I'm not sure. I have a party. Yeah, he could add in a video. I have a party tonight at 9 o'clock for part of my Hostess of the Month Club. I try not to keep my parties too much on Friday nights. It happens periodically, maybe once a month. But if I keep them all on Thursday nights, then Art and the kids are gone to cap with John. And so I'm not really taking up any of my mommy time with the kids. And I'm just using the time alone to um, party with some 31 ladies. I'll show you the driveway. The driveway has been all seal coated and now we just have to wait for it to dry. We're not gonna drive on it tonight because they said you can drive on it after six hours, but in past experience, it's still not totally set up. So we're gonna wait until at least tomorrow before we get it driven on. And in the meantime, we'll just store the cars somewhere else. Two, one. No, we're done. Yay, it came out good. Look at that. Yum. This is a new recipe. Hopefully it came out good. And then I'll just put a little bit of frosting on it just before we leave. But that looks like a nice cake to bring for everybody. Janelle is putting frosting on her cake that she made. It's a pumpkin it cake. Good. Yes, and do they know where we're going with the cake? We're going to a friend's house for dinner. And they asked that we bring the dessert. So that's what we're bringing. Because we had our driveway worked on today, we had to park our vans up at the shop. So we're walking to the shop. We managed to get out of the house, which was no small feat, trying to get everything in order because I have my party at nine and I have a lot of party posts that needed to go up. So I finished that up and then I realized that because I was partying last night, my whole purse was ripped apart. So then I went, was trying to get all the pieces and parts back to my purse and then I realized something else and then I went, oh, we don't have diapers or baby wipes in the purse. So I had to go back and get that. 
but we made it. We got gas, and I think we're doing pretty good. What do you think, Art? I'm th I was just thinking that must have been a pretty wild party if you had to rip your purse apart. Well, it's a purse party, Art. Oh, okay. <laughs> Tell them that maybe they're thinking it's a wild party. Nah, it's a first party. Charity and I are on our way into AC Moore. She broke, she crocheted so much, she broke her crochet hook. Yeah. So we need to get another one so she can keep doing her project. It was right on our way. Yeah. So we're gonna quick run in. We left Art and the kids in the Beast Bus. Let's see how fast we could make this. All right, there's the needles over here. Oh, isn't that pretty? Those well, that, are pretty. The, what I found at AC Moore is it's all spin offs of the brands. Oh, See, okay. like this is the blanket. Chateau, yarn. Yeah, okay, here we go. Oh, that's a whole lot. 11 and a half, a P16. Yeah. 299. Is that what you're looking for? So this is the one I have. That's one I broke. That's the one that you broke. There's less in those than these guys. Yeah. This is what Charity made two ponchos out of it, and they were gorgeous. I don't know. Have you shown them your ponchos recently? No. Oh, I, well, absolutely I don't gorgeous. Have any. In fact, when we first looked at this yarn, Charity was like, I don't yeah. like it, but it worked up beautifully. Oh, Charity, look at this one. Look at this color. Yeah, I was That is about stunning. That. And the gray is really classic. Is this the one you did hidden? Is it Echo? Um. Echo. Yep, that's, that's my color. So this was the colors that she did the last two ponchos in. Absolutely stunning. And Charity wants to check out their big bags of clearance and see if things she can find anything. Is that um, cotton? Um, it is 100% cotton. So it says right there. So this but would I, be a pound. Yeah. That's not a bad price. No, they have a lot of that cotton actually. So there's more of it. The blue over there. I wonder if you'd find any of that that you were just looking at. We are done! Now don't break this one. Give, it, on give it a little time before you break it. Well, I had that other one for two years. Two oh, plus years well, you so. use it a lot. Look at that. Art is filming me. Yeah. He's in the Beast Bus. He has one camera and I have one camera. And we are both... It took minutes. Oh, it took us 14 yeah. minutes. Hi, guys! <laughs> and they locked us out. Thank you very much. Here they come. It took them 14 minutes and they are on their way. And look at that. And look at that. That's what it looks like it when Peter Peter. That's what it looks like when Janelle is getting a video. It looks like that. Usually you don't see her get a video because she's too busy getting a video. Uh oh, I didn't lock it. Kid, here we go. Why did it take you 13 uh -oh. It took me a long time because the lady in front of us was buying, was buying lots of caskets. Real caskets for real people in? No, not for real people. They're wooden ones that I presume she was going to have as a craft project for kids to decorate. That sounds like fun. <laughs> she kidding. had a whole bunch of pumpkins and skeletons and then she had glue and, and then she had a massive stockpile of caskets. Okay, interesting. <laughs> How big were the caskets? Yeah, about that big. Okay. They're just wooden craft Look caskets. That, that Do you see anything wrong with that? Well, you know what my first thought was? is you'll have a lot of those on the clearance section and I'll probably see on Pinterest some really creative ideas for casket shaped boxes that won't be they won't be for caskets they'll be like jewelry boxes they'll come up with some creative thing because somebody will pick them up for like 10 cents a box on clearance because people won't buy them. Are you gonna be, are you gonna be here the day after Halloween to grab some caskets? I am purging, remember? I am enjoying my free life. Caskets are not on my high list of priorities to Of course, decorate. you don't want to die. Okay, well, let's get moving. Let's go. We are just getting ready to leave our friend's house. I have a party at 9, and it's 8.28. Hopefully, we can do it. I know it's about 30 minutes up here, so I might be blowing in, but we had a wonderful time. The kids had a lot of fun hanging out with their friends, and just a, a delightful evening. <laughs>